The Max Pro is a product from Honeywell, which used as Network Video Recorder, Max Pro NVR, and Video Management System, Max Pro VMS. This video is to explain how to make license for these two softwares. I have uploaded a series of videos on my channel for detailed process for Max Pro NVR and Max Pro VMS licensing. Step 1. How to create host ID file in Max Pro NVR or VMS which have been shown in the earlier video. Link given in the description. Step 2. How to climb or generate license certificate file online using Honeywell's software license delivery tool, which also shown in the earlier video. Link given in the description. This video is for third step. How to upload generated license file into Max Pro NVR or VMS. Without any ado, let's start the video. Once we downloaded license file, go to Max Pro. As you can see on the screen, the Max Pro running as trail version, it will expire within 29 days. To make it full version, I have to upload the license. I have license file which was downloaded from Honeywell's license delivery tool, which provides license online. Let's upload it. Go to user menu. Then click on about. A new interface window will open. Here user can check present software update history, such as patches, and Max Pro software. Recently I have updated Max Pro NVR 6.0.0.622, with the patch 6.3.0.643, which is recent release from Honeywell, to continue licensing process. Click on License. License Management Console Interface window will open. Here user can check his present license details. To upload new license, click on lock symbol, located at top left side of the window. New license configuration, wizard will open. This wizard helps user to apply a new license, for Max Pro NVR, and VMS applications. To continue, click on next. Locate your license file, by clicking on browse button. A new My Computer window will open. Select the license file, which was downloaded from Honeywell's license delivery tool, shown in previous video. To continue, click on Next. New License Preview and Comparison Wizard will open. Here, user can preview the features of new license and check the impact on existing device configurations after uploading the license file. To continue, click on Next. System Configuration Changes Interface screen will open. Here, user can check the System Configuration Changes report. To continue, click on Next. Confirm your new license, wizard. System giving in warning as. Clicking on Finish button, any configuration related to unlicensed devices will be deleted permanently. It means if user added any unlicensed camera into NVR, any unlicensed NVR into VMS, or any other devices, which is unlicensed, it will remove that devices permanently. To continue, click on Next. System asking final confirmation, as, are you sure you want to apply license? To continue, click on OK. Once user clicks on OK, it will take a moment to apply the new license. Once new license applied, if you observe the highlighted area, it changes license type, limited by days, to permanent and license remaining, 29 days, to not applicable. It means license installed successfully. This console is showing newly installed license features. User can verify the same by browse through above listings. Let's close all wizard. As you can see on the screen, in the beginning of this video, it was showing an alert for license. Now there is no more alerts on the screen. It means the software have been licensed. Next video I will make on how to make license for Max Pro VMS and Max Pro VMS clients. Hope you learn detailed process for licensing for Max Pro NVR and VMS. If you have any queries or you require technical support for your systems, contact Easy Robotech support team. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.